All right, to set up the sharpening jig, the first thing is to put the cutter in and extend it out, oh, maybe three-eighths of an inch or so. This is not quite as critical as the extension of your bowl gouge in the very grind jig. I find eyeball is just fine, if, 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 uh, but it wouldn't hurt to make a, a little measurement if you wanted to, but I just eyeball it. And then rather than moving your very grind and, and, or, or your Wolverine jig for the very grind, just leave that set, put a good cutter in there, match the bevel up to the wheel and find where it uh, needs to pivot here. And I drill a little dimple in the arm. And that way you can always leave this set for the bowl gouge. So you put it there, we'll turn the grinder on. Come over to the right side of the wheel. It's just that simple. Nice repeatable results every time. Now if you have radius wheels like this, you're gonna find that you'll uh, run into, the, well, any kind of wheel, you're gonna grind away bits of this uh, jig at times. That doesn't hurt a thing. But particularly if you have these radius edge wheels, because you wanna get over on the flat part of the wheel. There you go.